Hello everyone. Welcome back. I'm Fortunata Hope, the makeup lover. Thank you for coming back. Thank you for my new subscribers. If you haven't subscribed, it's free. Come on. If you're looking for all makeup lover, drugstore, high end, brand name, just the love of makeup, and you just want to play and just kick back and watch some new eye palettes and shadows and lipstick and foundation and some life stories, some encouragement, then come on, I'm your girl. So, that being said, let's get into the video. <laughs> Alrighty, y'all. This is going to be a two and two. We're going to do my eyeshadow with this new palette I received. I ordered this palette before I ordered Coffee Shop, uh, Juvia's Place Coffee Shop. If you hear any noise in the back, I'm washing clothes. So, but I got this one. I saw it on YouTube by Plastic Boy Gary Thompson. So, this is the case. And I got, I ordered this before I ordered Juvia's. So, I got this one before Juvia's, but I wanted to put Juvia's out first. But here is the casing on this baby. Ooh, told y'all I'm still in the chocolate fanatics. Chocolate, chocolate. But this baby, ooh, let me get this plastic up. Now, some people will say, girl, you just bought that coffee one and it has chocolate, but this got some berries, some burgundy in here. She's gorgeous. And I bought it, I paid full price. They went and had Black Friday sale. I got an alert that, you know, it was on sale. I paid, what was it? I wanna say, 20, that was my invoice. I think it was originally $20, 12 dollars, 20. It was under 20 and they had it for six. So while I was in there, I saw on the site, I saw this beauty. It's the makeup, oh, you can see everything. Makeup Revolution, the Ultimate Lights. This one was on sale when I got it. And look at this beauty. Kind of to blind you. So, I'm gonna play in her. She got some rubies, she got some berries in this one. So we gonna do her probably another time. But we are gonna get into Plastic Boy. And like I said, it's a two and two. Y'all know you saw my video about a month ago, almost going on two months on House of Lab. And I had uh, the shade 440. And while I was applying it and doing the video, I'm looking here in my mirror, the camera's right here. So it was looking like it matched on the mirror. But then on the camera, it was looking worn. But I was able to, you know, the finishing look was good, but it bothered me. And I was like, why is that? And then I started seeing a lot of YouTubers who was reviewing, trying out the foundation. And they were saying they were having a hard time trying to find their perfect shape. So I was going off the twin shades, you know, what they were going for. And I was like, okay, okay. And that's what, that's what got me. It the shade finder on Sephora and on the side, it threw me off. It had me in 415 or 425. So, that part of October, November, first part of November, I went into Sephora. So I called my girl who is the district manager of the Sephora. And I was like, yay, Jamie, um, I want to bring this back and exchange it. And so she was like, okay. So I went in and I got matched. I got matched to three shades and they were in the 300 numbers. 
Shade Finder told me off of my Anastasia Beverly Hills that I was 425 and for and another uh what was it Sephora's brand whatever was saying I was 415 and come to find out when they swatched me they swatched me on my wrist they swatched me here and they swatched me on my face I ended up walking out with two shades 350 medium cool 350 and they gave me a sample of 370. so after i do the eye look i'm gonna do some swatches so you can see and then we'll go into the base and complexion so right now let me prime my eyes and we're gonna get into this beautiful chocolatey looking it's smooth it's so smooth makeup revolution the plastic boy gary thompson all right eyes all primed since i'm using makeup revolutions eyeshadow i figure i go into my super base makeup revolution eyeshadow and i set it with my transition powder by laura mercier i don't know why it's coming off blue okay you're gonna get into this so take this plastic film off and this is what the palette is looking like and i'm gonna go in with Pooh right here and he has the cutest names on here parsley period cool okay madness plastic w i t w what in the world I guess that's what it stands for. Babes, Baddy, Rocks, Sip and Slay, Mavis, Accrur, Above Me, Sis, The Moment, Bougie. Okay, so we're going into Pooh, which is this one right here. Okay, I'm done with you, so. Where's my brush? Going in with my Morphe. No, I'm not gonna use you right now. I'm going with Jacqueline. Jacqueline JH30. It has a mirror, so I think I might use the mirror. And I'm going in with Pooh. Ooh. She came up on here. So I'm just gonna go right here, right above the crease. I'm gonna place it right here, like a transition. And just gonna go here. She's looking good. Deepen it up just a little bit more. Yeah, just gonna drag it here, bend it out. Just looking good so far. That's pretty. And it blends smoothly on top of that transition. And there's no fallout. That's great. I'm gonna do the other side. Makeup Revolutions palettes, they are a little, you know, they're high pigmented. So you have to watch it because they are buildable and that's only with two swatches so now I'm going in with my Morphe F Morphe M504 and I want to deepen up my crease so I'm going in with this berry color rot this one right here and I'm taking that into the crease and I'm gonna start from the outer Go. Ooh. 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 Mm. 
and taking that directly into the crease. Baby, that is gorgeous. I'm not gonna take it no higher because I don't want to mix it up in poo, my top one. I go in, I wanna deepen it up. Oh, that's pretty. Yeah, I'm gonna deepen this crease up. Okay. And I'm gonna go back in just a little bit on poo to blend out those edges. Keep it high, don't bring it down, but it's gonna blend out those edges. So I'm gonna do the other side that was rocked. This is a beautiful palette, y'all, I'm sorry. I'm just gonna go on the outer, go into that crease, keep it low. It's good to have like a brush that has like a point on it. Morphe M504, I was looking because I was cleaning brushes. I got like four of these. And some was still in the little wrapper. So I'm just gonna go into the crease, keep it low. I'm sorry, y'all. I love my creases to be a little bit more definition. Now, no color. I just want to buff out lightly the edges since I added some more definition. Just slightly bluff. Bluff out. Lord Jesus. All right. And so far, that's what she's looking like. Now I've got to go into the outer. I'm going to sip and slay this one right here for the outer. Not gonna, I don't know if I wanna smoke it, smoke it. But we gonna see. So I'm gonna start lower V, make my little V. Okay, now that brush I had with rock, I'm gonna go back in and just gonna kind of diffuse that out a little so I won't lose my color and my crease. And I'm gonna do the same for the other side. So in a way, I'm just making sure there's no harshness from that outer V color and my crease color giving a little smoke all right so now uh, where did they go sorry about that I was looking for my glitter girls so I already put some on here now I'm going into bougie which is this little shimmery one right here and put on top they're very I could say creamy let's just see I'm gonna pat this on
Oh, that's pretty. Oh, that's gorgeous. Ooh. I'm just gonna blend it here so it looks like. Ooh. This is gorgeous. Oh my God, that is gorgeous. All right, let me just do the other eye. I'm gonna use my glitter glue, back of my hand. And put the top back on. Put you so I can find you next time. And my good old Wet n Wild flat brush. And we'll put you right there. Pick up my palette. And then we'll go right from the inner corner. Just like if I'm doing a, like if y'all were doing a cup crease and some lids. Pack it on right here. And take it over here. Okay. With my Sigma eyeshadowing bust brush B55, I'm gonna go into Bougie and load it up. And I'm just gonna pack it on, starting from inner and follow where I made like a little cut crease with my glitter glue. Um, I might need a little bit more. There we go. There we go, there we go, there we go. Bam! Now, I'm gonna go back into rock just around where I put it to give it a little bit more. I think it looks like it's a cut crease, but it's really not. But you know, a bit more definition towards where I put the glitter glue at and the shimmer shade. Ooh, that looks pretty. And put no more. I just want to intensify the outer V and blend these in. As you see, I didn't put no more product, so I'm just gonna use what, what if any is left on here, and just blend it together. Give it like a, I want to say, almost like an ombre. The ombre look. Go in here. Buff it out some. Merge the colors together. So it looks all together. I'm thinking about putting like a topper on here. Let's get on to the skin complexion and I'm gonna finish up the eyes. All right, I just put my primer on. Still rocking my milk, y'all. Still rocking her. That's this is Bay now. This is Bay. It's been Bay when I had the little trial one, and I upgrade to the big one. This is Bay. You ain't got it. <clears throat> you need to get it. It's real good. So with that on, let's get on to this House of Labs by Lady Gaga. Now my other video I got and I did it. I didn't go in the store. I ordered same day delivery. And like I stated before, I was going through and trying to find the right shade and trying to, you know, my twin shades, some of my twin shades hadn't purchased it at that time. They didn't purchase it. I'm just shaking it up. See, little, it's gorgeous. And so they didn't buy it or get it or do a video until um, the VIB sale. So I have 350, which is one I bought, and my girl hooked me up. She gave me three of these. This is shade 370, House of Black. And I'm scared because this thing is filled to the top and I haven't opened it. 
two more cheeses. because this is filled. It would help if I was opening it on the right end. Okay. So we're going to do a little swatch here and maybe right here. So we'll start here. Y'all can see. I need to put my chair up some. Hold on. Okay. Now, you okay, y'all know you can see. So this is three... The shade 370. All right, where's the light? Okay, put it right here. Okay, you can see it. Can you see it? Okay, that's 370, right? I'm gonna put it on my face so I can close this up. And here's three, put it on this side. 370, okay? Dang, where is it? Okay, all right. Make sure you're closed. That's 370. So get me a wipe. That's 370. I'm gonna be mad in a minute. Because <laughs> that's 370, right? I should have put it on this side so y'all can see it. On this side. Okay, hold on. Hold on. I got y'all. I got y'all. Let me put it on this side since the camera's right here. Alright. Where's the tab? I'm gonna take this off anyway, so oh well. All right. Oh, can y'all see it? All right, here we go. Three seventy. Three seventy on my chest. Three seventy here. And three seventy here. Hope y'all can see that. Okay, where's my wife? Now we're gonna go into the bottle that I bought. That's 370. That looks good, doesn't it? That looks like that is my shade, right? We're gonna go in 350. Now I'm gonna pump this out. All right, this is the consistency of it. All right, I still got 370 on me. This is 350, okay? Now, there's 370, and I'm gonna go right next to it. Okay? Is this 370? It's 350. In here. Can you see? Now I'm all confused. <laughs> I'm all compagulated. Okay. 350 and 370. I'm just gonna blend that out some. You know what? Ooh, 370's looking good. 350s looking. There's 350. 350. You can't really tell now because it's been on and it's oxidizing. When I was in the store, Sephora, and she swatched it on me, she swatched it on my wrist, she swatched it on my chest, and she swatched it on my side of my face because I had no makeup on. 350. You couldn't even see where she put it at. This is 350. And this is 370. So that and I even went to their the Sephora has a window, no the store, you know, windows, not like in the mall. So I was able to go out, go by the door, the windows or the door, and use the natural light. Because I know how Sephora lighting is, right? And it still came off. We couldn't find 350 on my skin. They could see 370 because 370 was is more orangey like. So I haven't used this foundation since I bought it. And this is my first time swatching it. Now I'm like, I could see 350 and I could barely see 370 in my own lighting. I have a ring light, I have a cube light, I got my blinds open. I got my chandeliers on top. 
So, this is 370. So, I'm going to go with 350, what I bought, because I'm over here talking about, I finally got my right match. It, you can't even tell, you can't even see it. But now I'm like, I'm in my own lighting and I'm like, I can't really see it. So I'm gonna conceal and then I'm gonna be right back. I don't think I still got some. Okay, I meant to say color correct and you know, I'm still rocking my Makeup Revolution Conceal and Correct and orange as my color corrector. So now shake her up real good. And then I'm going with one, two pumps, okay? And I'm gonna, matter of fact, where is she at? I'm gonna use my Morphe flat brush and I'm gonna spray my brush just a little. Well, two. And. That was two pumps. And you don't know House of Labs has, um, where's the box? It's got uh, Bioferment, Seven Complexions, Intelligence, and Sex com uh, Seven Complex, infused with 20 plus skincare ingredients, buildable, med medium coverage, luminous, and second skin finish, ultra fluid, weightless weightless formula and i can tell i can i can i can vouch for that from when i got the other shade that yes it is weightless yes it does give you that second skin yes it is luminous yes it is buildable but i'm just gonna go with those two pumps that's it I'm just gonna go with the two. Cause it's looking good. It looks good. I don't like it. But either way, it's like this. I have 350 and I have some samples of 370. I think 370 could be like when I get starts getting warmer or what have you. But right as of right now, I'm loving this 350. Y'all tell me. And I'm going in with my Sephora Best Skin Ever uh, Concealer in 34.5 in. I've been loving this. I haven't used her in a minute, so she's probably mad at me. She can join the club. Hold on, hold on. Oh, I'm killing, I'm wasting time. I'm too late. I forgot to put something on, but oh well. What else in you? To conceal, I'm 
going in with my Lori Mercier Translucence, my powder puff. Tap some of it off, and it's gonna set under my eyes where I put the concealer. Ah, yeah, with the concealer. All right. All right. I'm going to contour my nose with my Nika AK New York. And this is in Coco. Oh, that's a little bit too much. Uh, okay. Now, just gonna blend this out a little. Okay. Contour. I'm going in with my Makeup Revolution Glow Splendor Ultra Matte Bronzer in Dark. the brush I'm going to use? I guess. Nope. Alright, let me spray my face. Let me go on with my haven't used her in a minute. My MAC Prime Fix It Plus Coconut. Push it in. This is also going to help if I put too much contour on my face that we can get even. Speaking of that, let me do a reverse contour. Just want to chisel out my contour line. Girl, you know you can't see that. That well, that good. All right, so blush. I'm going in with Chivalry Blush from Makeup Geek. I was able to get some of her discounted products. This is like a terracotta color.
highlights, I'm going in with, I had it, I had her here. I, oh, what in the world? I had it here. Ooh. Oh, here you go. Sticking with Makeup Revolution. This is the Revolution Glow Splendored Ultra Glow Highlighter. And this is what she looks like. So, then. Lightly fan it over. Little mist on it. I'm just gonna. I need to put this brush down, this highlighter down. I got it, I got the glow. I might even put some more blush on, but let's finish up these eyes. Okay. We're gonna finish up these. Something feel like it's tickling my nose. Okay, let's finish this up. Um, My eyes. Let's go back in the eyes. Let's go back in the palette. Where's my smudger? All right, I'm gonna throw on some lips. You know, everybody's saying their favorite reds for the holidays or special things. So I'm gonna go in with Dose of Colors Charm. And I'm gonna leave the moisture on my lips because this bad boy can, can dry. Lipstick on my And here we have it. I went in with Dose of Colors uh, Charm. And then I was like, mm, okay. But then I was like, you know what? I'm just gonna up it up a little. My fave, any ruby red burgundy color lipstick. L Air, which is discontinued from ColourPop but I, it came in like the bulk lip liners from ColourPop. So I got one in there and I got two out here. L Air, this bad boy, that's Holy Grail. So I went in with that and then mascara, I finally found and came across my baby. Oh, where is she? Anastasia, Beverly Hills um, mascara. Lash Brag 
Romanizing mascara, so I went in with that. And I went in with my NYX Esmeralda in the liner. And then for my highlight, for my inner corner and eye brow highlighter, I went in with Mavis from the palette. And this is what I got. And I just sprayed it down, pat her down, and this is it. This is the end result. So if you haven't checked out Plastic Boy on YouTube, that's his channel, Gary Thompson. And if you make a revolution, all my Make a Revolution fans, my favorite, you know, this is Make a Revolution's products. You know, this is a beautiful palette. And this is the shades. And it has the aluminum tin. Most of them come in this aluminum tin. But this is a gorgeous palette. Amazing brand. I love Makeup Revolution. I bought this with my own money, so this is not sponsored or no PR. All my makeup, except for a couple, you know, I got came from Marky. Makeup Revolution. So, but other than that, for free, they came for free. But here's the foundation. Now tell me what you think. Is this the right color? Is this the better shade than the other video of House of Labs by Lady Gaga? And this is in 350, the shade. It looks good. I feel like I got nothing on my face. That's why I felt, that's why I was so insisting on finding the right shade. If I had to go into the store and have them to test it. And they test me for, well really I was tested for three, three, 330. 360 was too pink. It was real peachy, pinky like on me. Uh, 370, 385, which I thought I was gonna be. It was a little bit bronzy, a little bit darker. That could be my, if I'm in the sun, deep, deep dark. But this one right here, no, oh, I wiped it off. This looks good. So tell me if you tried, if you found your shade, if you had to go in as well and get uh, shaded up, you know, find that for yourself. But it's a gorgeous, gorgeous finish, gorgeous foundation. And this is not being sponsored. I bought this for, uh, I bought the original and I went and exchanged and they gave me another one. And they end up telling me they owe me some money. I got a refund back on it. I guess it's because it was part of the Black Friday B.I.B. about to come on when I went in. So they, I end up, I end up getting it cheaper than what it was on sale. I mean, what it was and on sale. Cause they gave me some money. Cause this is like a, what's this, a forty-six dollar foundation? And I got some pretty chains. I got some, I got some change back. And I end up. Having a pagan on the Sephora card, and I went shopping back in there and got me some other stuff when I went in. So, no judgment on this thing, okay? <laughs> but other than that, it's a beautiful foundation. I love it. Thank God I got the right shade this time. But until next time, I'll see you again. And have a wonderful day. Have a blessed day. Stay strong. Stay beautiful. Stay prayed up. And treat people the way that you want to be treated. Until next time, I'm your girl. Hey, I almost forgot. What's going on? If you ain't liked, comment or subscribe to your girl. Hey, y'all, come on. It's the last month of this of the year, 2023. I'm gonna get back on my, like I was last year. Things happen, life goes on, but I'm still here. I'm still here, your girl's still here. Catch me on here or catch me on my Instagram channel. Come on, we family, la familia. For favor, let's do this. I'm your girl, Fortunata, the makeup lover, and thank you for coming to my channel. Bye. Where go, where go? Oh, that's pretty. Mm-mm-mm.